What is up, everybody? Uh, today is a random uh, live stream for me. Um, I wasn't able to really be on the Wolfpack uh, last night, so I really, really wanted to um, talk about this artisan Jack Sparrow that uh, was previewed last night. And um, they actually asked me, they're like, hey, you know, I know you missed the Wolfpack, but we're, we're going live again. Get your butt in here. I was like, man, I'm like in bed already. So if you guys haven't known, I've been on vacation, uh, more like a staycation, but I got family in town and I want to make sure that I'm not like doing live streams while they're in town. Here I am. Okay. Now there's a catch. She's actually, uh, my niece is actually with my wife right now. They went on a coffee run and they're going to sit down, have coffee, talk, blah, blah, blah. So that's really cool. Um, so it gave me like an hour to kind of talk about this Jack Sparrow. I'm a, I'm a pretty big pirates fan i'm more of a jack sparrow fan i think more of a johnny depp fan uh, i really liked uh the first three pirates movies i will say and i really do wish that this jack sparrow was from the og the first movie um but you know what it's jack sparrow it's artisan we got three different versions to talk about and it's going to be a crazy crazy live stream because i may or may not be able to uh to uh you know get a chance to uh, RSVP without saying too much more. I don't know. But anyways, uh, let's check in with the chat real quick uh, as we get started here. We got the movie cannon stopping by. I'd be the first on these uh, high seas. Won't, won't be getting them, but I'm excited for the community. I'll check if my younger brother wants the Artisan Jack, though. Make sure to RSVP on Sideshow. Yeah, make sure to RSVP um, or don't. That's, that's fine. Um, you know, don't do that. Um, we got action in the box in the house. Hi, Brick. Uh, what's up, man? Uh, I was actually going to ask you a question. Um, are you getting the avatar figures? Because if you are, uh, I would love to see what you do with, uh, the display for those two figures. I, I could just imagine a bunch of greenery, maybe some water in the background. Somehow I could just see you doing a phenomenal job with those avatar figures. And I was thinking about you. Um, we got hammer of God. Hey, Brick. What is up, Hammer of God? Thank you guys for being here. Tyria in the house. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Uh, we have Jerry. Um, let's uh hi from the nether. Wow, from the Netherlands. Awesome. Uh, very cool. Guys, I appreciate you guys being here. This is literally a uh, last minute live stream. About an hour ago, I got this thing ready. So uh highly appreciate it. There's 15 in the house. Make sure to hit that like button. Um we got Brian uh, Maju Space himself. Yo, Brick. Yo, Brian. What is what is good, man? Good to see you here. The Jedi Knights Watch. Stall them. Yeah, guys, just stay right here. Don't even worry about what's going on outside of here. Um, boy. Yes, yes. Uh, movie Canon. Uh, yo, ho, ho, everyone. Uh, Jedi saying hi to Brian. Um, let's see. Action box of Jack Sparrow is crazy good. Yeah, he is crazy good. We'll we'll get into that here as well. So um really excited, really, really excited to um to talk about this this figure here. 
Let's see. The deluxe non-artisan has wool hair as well, except for the braids. Oh, really? So not the janky frizzy hair. Okay. Okay. Didn't know that. So I appreciate you telling me that before we talk about the figure so I can act like I knew that. Um, <laughs> X-Man Supreme. Bro, I'm absolutely getting on these. This is great. I appreciate that, X-Man. It really means a lot. You're literally in on every live stream uh, that I'm doing, and I highly appreciate that, honestly. Um, action in the box. Avatar is too big, but I will think about it. Please do. Please do. I might pay you to get them so that I could see this display. <laughs> Um, okay. Let's see. Uh, I was supposed to be on here with a special guest. We were supposed to get battle damage Flavio, uh, but he can't make it due to a good reason, I guess. But if he doesn't accomplish his goal, then I will, um, I will, I will hold this against him on, uh, the bugle six on Monday. Uh, by the way, bugle six, Monday, eight 30 central, uh, new episode coming out. It is the, uh, first of April. So get ready for a lot of, a lot of fun on April fool's day on the bugle six. Uh, okay. So before we get started talking about this, I do want to just, um, talk about a couple things. First, I want to talk about the subscriber count. Uh, absolutely thankful 100% for all my subscribers, 7,871 and counting. Obviously we don't have 7,000 in the house. That would be nice. Right. Um, obviously I got a lot of these from, uh, short videos, but thankful for those, uh, as it shows that the same people are watching my shorts and you guys, of course, as well. So highly appreciate that. Yes. I got this kind of rundown from Shane one, six figure focus. I like that he did it. So I, I just kind of stole that from him. Hope he's cool with it. <laughs> you better be. Um, let's see. Uh, I also want to talk about the brickyard. We have three members of the Brickyard, and we got Nif, Nif, <laughs> Nif, Nick Lifts Sticks, the Movie Cannon, and Danny Spotchka. Guys, to all three of you, thank you for being a part of the Brickyard. If you guys aren't members yet and you guys are wanting to be members, uh, there should be uh, a way to do that either on this live stream or on my actual homepage on YouTube. So if you want to be a part of the Brickyard, go ahead and, and join the fun. You get some pretty cool perks with that. So thank you guys. Um, let's see. We also have one more thing to show you. Um, and that is boom, boom, boom. Trying to stall. <laughs> um, we have, uh, a quick little, uh, 18% off code you guys could use for figures like artisan. I'm sorry, not artisan, uh, figures like, um, in art. And some statues, other Hot Toys figures. You get eighteen percent off code. Use Brick Six at Collector Zone. Uh, always appreciate Collector Zone and all the work that he does around the community and the help that he does for me. Uh, he has a his own segment, pretty much, on my Bugle Six uh, live stream. And he, um, you know, I, I'm able to get an eighteen percent off code for you guys to use for these amazing figures that Hot Toys comes out with. Um, and in art and of course any statues or any other collectibles that you guys are into, we can look into that, but, um, yeah, 18% off. And just so you guys know, shipping and tax are all included in that price. So make sure to take that into consideration when you're looking through his, his store. All right. So I'm going to check something real quick because yeah, I just, I got to make sure that I, uh, I get in this queue for this thing. Um, not sure what I'm trying to get into. I got to stall you guys, but <laughs> let's, let's talk about this figure uh, a little bit. I'm going to open this up and share the screen once again. And we are going to start with. Jack Sparrow artisan edition. Let's see here, guys. Give me one second. Boop, boop, boop. All right. So we have some really, really cool stuff here. Um, I mean, who doesn't like Jack Sparrow? I mean, you get you get the two the two head sculpts. Well, I guess it's more like a face because you swap out the faces, so interchangeable uh face sculpts with separate rolling eyes, which is amazing. And um man, I'm trying to figure this out here. Um 
Let's see. Uh, all right. So, yes. So we have these separate face plates. We have the wool hair, which is really cool. And <laughs> this awesome base. I love this base, guys. Sure, it's it's a lot like the previous uh, Jack, I almost said Johnny Depp, but the previous Jack Sparrow that we have seen with, you know, the steering wheel and everything. But I really like the uh, the waves, uh, how that kind of goes around. It kind of reminds me of the shark a little bit from the other uh, Jack Sparrow, but just a lot of cool stuff here. Really hoping that the um, the sword and the gun are all die cast from what I've heard before. They were. Um, now I, I never had a Jack Sparrow, but I've been to Jedi's house and I've seen, he's, he's had both, I believe. Uh, I've def definitely seen the one with the steering wheel. Um, so I'm really hoping that they stay die cast. I'm sure they will. Uh, you know, and we also have the leather. So this is actual leather for these, this artisan version, his belt and, um, his like his bag. And I'm guessing his hat would be leather too. I, I'm not a hundred percent sure. Um, but yeah, so let's see here. So, so that I don't look like a tool. Um, I'm actually really trying to get on the queue as you guys probably know by now. Um, this is supposed to be up and running 10 o'clock Pacific time. So I don't see anything yet. I'm hoping by 1145. So I'm not all over the place. If you guys know that it's open, you want to be kind enough to let me know that I can get into the queue, please, please let me know. Cause, uh, I would like to have a chance to get this thing live on, on, on air. So, uh, you guys can see my disappointment in person. Cause we all know how these things work. Right. Um, but there are actually three different versions of this. Yeah. Hammer of God says, um, it just opened. It's a random queue. Yeah. They're always random which is always fun but i always like to jump on especially if i'm live so that i'm not like going back and forth and i can just wait um i still don't see it though darn it i'm gonna i'm gonna like lose my mind on this stream guys you're, you're gonna see me get really pissed oh man somebody send me a link um let's see yeah the queue's not opening for me so that's fun um hmm hmm Okay, so Jedi said he can't get in the queue yet either. So that makes me feel a little better. I'm going to try again in a minute at 45 because that sounds like a right time. Uh, good luck, Brick. Thank you, Movie Cannon. I appreciate that. Uh, oh, click on the link. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. Everybody uh, sit tight, sit tight. I appreciate you guys um, watching this and not getting upset with me that I'm... Uh, here we go. You know what? I'm just going to... Yeah. Where did my link go? There it is. Okay. Thank you, Tyria. I appreciate that. I am in the queue. I'm probably, I know it's random, but I, I, there's part of me, part of me feels like, you know, um, first come, like you have a higher chance to get a better number. <laughs> I don't know. So I, I hope that doesn't mess me up. 15 minutes to go, guys. Um, either way, I'm definitely going to be getting a, a, um, a figure, uh, whether it is the artisan version or not. I really, really want a Jack Sparrow and and happy that I <laughs> send me a link to uh, happy that I'm able to get at least something here, at least whether it's, you know, the artisan version or not. So, uh, yeah, man, send it, send it in the chat, uh, Tyria, go, go for it, man. Um, if somebody in the chat gets it though, and I don't, then I will have somebody to blame. So that would be nice. So please do that. So I, I don't blame myself. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to, I had an idea what I was going to do with the show, but then right before I jumped on here, um, I, I found out that it was today. So I'm going to switch it up a little bit. I'm actually going to uh, stop sharing this screen and I'm going to just talk about um, the pictures that we had on Facebook here. Oh, uh, actually, probably, there we go. Probably not because that's all screwy. Let's just let's just talk about this, guys. Let's just go back to here. So so we have let's see. We have the the uh, the wool hair, which is cool. Now that worries me a little bit because I do feel like it's going to get a little stringy or 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 just kind of like 
pop out of place a little bit. But I don't really move my figures a lot, to be honest. Um, or or you know, repose them. Uh, so I should be okay. And I, I guess it makes sense that they're they're face plates, right? Or face sculpts and not not head sculpts because you don't want to mess up the hair. So that will make it easier. That will make it good. Um, you're not messing up the hair doing that. But I still worry about that because I'm not good with stuff like that. Um, and we haven't really seen the Rudy yet with Artisan. You know, we have some good stuff, guys. Like we have we have the Joker. What was first? Was uh the, was uh Anakin first? I think Anakin was first. And then and then we had um and then we had Scarlet Witch. Was that second? And then Joker? Or am I missing one? I feel like I'm missing one all of a sudden. Um, let me know in the chat because my mind's all over the place looking at this uh looking at this thing here. Uh any idea on the price? says action in the box i've been hearing that the artisan version could very well be around 500 dollars, um and that's before shipping so that worries me i hopefully uh everyone who i've heard that from and myself are wrong hopefully it's more like 465 485 but i have a feeling it's gonna be like 495 to 520 or something like that but that's the only idea that i have uh, whether or not it is that price, I mean, it could always change. You never know. So under five, I'll be happy. Over five, I'm going to be a little nervous when I am, um, while I am purchasing. Uh, hopefully, it is 2025 release. I know a lot of people are probably like, no, 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 we need it. We need it this year with all the other artisans releasing. I could, I could honestly wait. <laughs> uh, there's, there's just so much coming out. We have the Guardian stuff that I have I have yet to pre-order, but I know where to get them. So I, I am safe on there, even though they are mostly gone from Sideshow. There are places to get them. Uh, and then I haven't pre-ordered any Ahsoka either. I, I recently just pre-ordered Return of the Jedi. So I was able to cop that. Uh, Vader, when I say Return of the Jedi, the Vader. Um, so I'm lucky that I got that one. Uh, because I think that one like was waitlisted for like five minutes. And Sneaker, Evil Sneaker, was telling me, I was like, oh, great, I missed it. So then it got back on. He's like, it's back up. It's back up. So I heard up and cop that like as soon as possible because uh, I didn't want to miss out. Yeah, I got that FOMO for real. Uh, Jedi says Joker, then Annie. Okay, so Anakin wasn't the first. For some reason, I remember Anakin being the first, but I, I'm, I'm wrong. That's cool. Um, so it must have been Anakin or Joker, then Anakin, then Scarlet Witch. Okay. And then, and now we have Jack Sparrow. Why am I thinking that there was a fifth, like another one? Man, I, I'm I'm losing it. Maybe it's because I got so excited for Paul Atreides and that's in art. And for some reason, in the back of my head, I think there's like another figure or something. Um, but guys, there's a lot of detail in this figure. And I'm sure they've upgraded the body compared to the last one. I'm sure, you know, the, the head sculpt looks phenomenal. I mean, some of these pictures, it just, it looks like Johnny Depp. It, it really, really does. And... It's clothing, the leather material. I mean, the the base. I, I really hope I'm able to get to get this uh, figure. Let me let me got, let me show you guys something real quick. Um, so there is a third option. Let's see, to where you don't get the 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 steering wheel base. Okay, so the third option is right here. Uh, you still get the interchangeable face sculpts. It, it looks like, oh, it looks like you get the steering wheel base. You just don't get like the water around it. Okay. Okay. I haven't really looked at this picture. So, so my bad guys. Uh, yeah. Leather boots, belts. Um, so that's, that's pretty sweet. And, um, it sounds like the, uh, deluxe version that is an artisan. Uh, I think Tyria said it earlier, uh, said that it's still wool. You just don't get the braids. So so that's that's cool i kind of want the braids though kind of want the braids let's check in with the chat um i'm kind of all over the place right now so uh hammer of god for sure size show will price it around 515 unless they don't stick uh to their 25 percent upcharge all in you're looking at 575 whoo um you know that's a lot that's a lot that's a lot of cheese a lot of money um now it is a it is a character in movies that I, I would say he's probably like, man, top 20 characters in all movies for me. Um, I'm not going to say his movies are like top 20, but the character itself, Johnny Depp's 
portrayal of Jack Sparrow, the Jack Sparrow is a classic. I remember seeing this movie, not this one, but the, the original movie, I believe I was 13 or 14 years old and saw it in theaters and I could not stop laughing. This movie was a lot of fun. And I think I saw the first three in theaters and then I saw the fourth and fifth movie later. I think when I, when I actually saw this one, the fifth one, I was kind of in and out of paying attention. Um, it was okay. Like, I'm not going to say it, it stunk. I know some people don't like it at all, but it was all right. It was all right. Um, so, you know, but the, that first one, man, his, his first appearance to the music, it was, it was, it's just, it's amazing. It's, it's really good. So 575 all in around 575. That's, that's tough, but I am spending, you know, for something on an in art, um, Paul Atreides. So if I can do that, I'm going to find a way to get Jack Sparrow. Like I said, as long as it's a 2025 release, because I don't want to, I don't want to go, you know, Delo the broke here, <laughs> as he says, um, and and that it's limited. I must have missed um, what they said before. Uh, X Man, uh, the hair looks way different though outside of just the dreads. Okay, the artisan has much thicker hair. Okay, well that's good. I think that's a good thing because you want to try and get this artisan, right? Like they, it needs to be a, a, a big enough difference. Can't just be, you know, the dreads or the braid. Um, Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman technically wasn't artisan, but was wool. Okay. And that turned out okay, right? I think uh, Sneaker has that figure and she looked really good. Um, I'm just afraid to touch it, you know, and like ruin it. <laughs> uh, X-Man Supreme. Yeah, it's weird. The description mentions wool hair. It's very confusing. It is. It is. And I, like I said, I'm just all over the place, guys. If you guys are stopping in, make sure to hit that like button. Wish me luck. I wish you guys luck. If you guys are going after this figure, put down in the comments if you guys are actually going for the artisan version or if you're just like, nah, like I don't need this or, you know, too much or, or you know, if you're going to go for a different version, let me know in the comments. Um, let's see. Can you PM me on Discord? Yeah, by the way, guys, we do have a Discord for the Wolfpack. If you guys want to uh, invite to that, let me know. Or like, uh, let Jedi know. wonder if it's a typo. Yeah, possibly. Um, we have D'Lo the Collector. Keep on bricking mofos. Yes. Keep on bricking. Wolfpack, baby. Uh, evil Sneaker, yo, yo. I hope you guys are paying attention more than I am because at least somebody in the Wolfpack needs to, needs to cop this figure because I don't want to screw it up for everybody. Just, uh, just myself, you know. Um, but it'll be fun. You guys can see my disappointment. I have a feeling I'm going to be like 6,000 on the, uh, on the queue here. Does anybody know how much, how many sideshow is getting? Um, cause that would be good to know. Um, Tyria says he's so iconic and classic. I think if I ask my little cousins who this is, they might know him. Yeah. That's the thing too, is like, you know, you, you have your collection and and then within your collection, there are figures that like guests, family, friends, whoever comes into your collection room will like point out right away. I'm I'm currently making a video. My my niece is in town, as I said in the beginning of the video, and her first reaction um, to to my setup and kind of like what her favorite figures are and which ones kind of stick out to her. So this is definitely one of those figures that 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 would uh, to a lot of people. Um I didn't know that what bricking meant, so I looked it up with on brand diction urban dic oh, on brand gosh urban dictionary and the first search result wasn't what I expected. Not gonna look that up. <laughs> Not going to do it. Um Doc Bat in the house. Sup all. What is up, Doc Bat? Good to see you. Um and do now on my laptop and queue now on my laptop and on my phone you know that's a good idea see what numbers higher see if, if they're the same that might be a good idea uh if anyone is going to pass hit me up i'll take it off your hands yeah guys i i hate to say this but if if this figure if the artisan figure comes out and it says release date 2024 um i will give mine to whoever wants it did not get it um for the price of and then i'll just get like another version 
Um, I'm just not going to be able to pull the trigger if it's a 2024 release. If it's 2025, I'm sorry, but I'm going to keep it. Um, but I'm not going to be one of those guys that are like, you know, 600 bucks or whatever. I guess this one's already five. So this would probably go for like 750 on eBay. Um, but yeah, oh, Tyria laughing. Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I guess I could look it up and share the screen and see what pops up. We have, have a good laugh before we get disappointed here. Um, okay. So we, we've got about four, a little less than four minutes, three minutes. Um, and I'm going to pop open a Red Bull. You guys are either going to see me smiling or stressing the out. Okay. Um, no, no, it's dirty. Laugh out loud. <laughs> I don't know if you can. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going to do that. But uh, I might see what it is after. Actually, I might not want to. It might not be my cup of tea. You know what I'm saying? Um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. So we got 16 in the house still, guys. Hit that like button. Good luck to everybody. Um, and then we have AZ Figs. Remember, multiple browsers and phone. Yeah, you know what? You know what? I am gonna do that. Let me let me Gmail here. I got a couple minutes. Let's see which one. Uh, let's see which which queue is higher here. I gotta go to all my mail because it, it is under spam, which is ridiculous. Every time I get an email from Sideshow. Somebody's like, oh, what's up? I'm like, I don't see it. So I got to go through my spam. All right, so two minutes, two minutes. Hopefully, you know, going on multiple screens doesn't mess you up in the long run. But um, if it does, it does. I would share my screen, guys. Should I share my screen? Yeah, you're not going to see like my, I'll share my screen. I don't think you're going to see like my payment plans and all that. Let's see. And if you do, then I'll delete the video. <laughs> I think I'm good though. Let's see where am i all right share screen let's see oh i can't because oh hold on hold on i can make this a whole different I can make this boom there we go there we go okay there we go window sorry guys i'm all over the place there we go share um okay i don't want that i don't want that i don't want that okay Let's try this again. Let's try this again. You guys are probably long gone by now. Um, present. Let's see if I get this, guys. I, I really hope you guys do. Um, actually, I, I feel like I'd be more happier if some other people got it than myself. Because for me, I'm just going to be stressing. So, uh, one minute. One minute. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. And if my number is better on my phone, then I'll on share screen. I, yeah, I'll probably unshare the screen, but uh, let's see. <laughs> we got X Men. I love this. I'm not stressed this time because the DX is so good. That is true. I wonder how much more the artisan is going to be from the DX, like price wise. We think of like 60, 80 bucks more, less. I'm going to say about 80 bucks. Um, yeah, totally agree. AZ Figs, are we going to see a live action? Yeah, live action disappointment. Uh, don't share your screen, just camera on you. Hmm. Yeah, I could. I could. You guys think I should take the screen off? Like, is it going to show like some random shit? I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to keep it on. And if I start seeing money, um, uh, you know, cards and stuff, here we go. Here we go. All right. Where am I? Where am I? Ahoy. Come on, calculate. My heart's beating. I want it to beat faster. I'm going to drink some Red Bull. Oh, I almost spilled it. All right. Come on. This is this is the thing. Usually, usually I take a bathroom break at work. And I'm doing this on the toilet. Um, so this is nice. Stressful. But it's nice <laughs> to not uh, to actually have pretty decent service um, while I'm doing this. We had a couple people leave. I'm sure they're trying to uh, get on get on it. Um, yeah. Hammer of God says no higher. I did the math. It was at least like 150, if I recall correctly, on the price. To oh, wow. Wow. All right. I'm wow. I'm 621. Let's go. Let's go. I should have a chance. Oh, on my phone, I'm 2,387. So whoever told me to open up multiple screens multiple screens i owe you 
AZ Figs was one, and somebody else told me too. So whoever told me to do that, like 100% owe you guys. Um, because or, or else I, I might not have been able to get this. Ooh, this is cool. This is cool. Um, once I start paying, I'm gonna on share my screen. Um, but I'll, you know, obviously show like the prices of each one real quick. Uh oh, Jedi. Uh 91. Nice. So he's getting it. Uh Tyria, let's F and go, brick. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Tyria. Oh, okay. 91 questioning Jedi. Yeah, that's like the highest I've seen. Like, imagine being number one. Um, oh, X-Men Supreme 149 and 374. Congrats. Jerry, 2297. I think you still might have a chance. Um, but we'll see. I mean, I I don't know. I don't know how many are how many sideshow has. Um, usually we get little notifications underneath to kind of tell us when they're like halfway out, stuff like that. Um, action in the box. Yes, I did it, my good sir. I did it. I did it. Oh, I did it. I did it. And you know what? I feel more stressed now because now it's it's money, but I'm getting it. <laughs> Movie Canon, good number, good number. Um, and you know what, guys? I'm not saying you guys have to do this, but if you guys have a good number but weren't planning on getting this, go ahead and and, and grab it because you can probably set up payment plans and then just if you know a friend or somebody who really wants it, you know, let them just get it from you. Um, because that's always awesome too. Don't be you know, one of those guys that puts it up for a grand and then, I mean, I guess if you want to do it, it's on whatever, it's your thing, but you know, I'm not going to judge you for it. I mean, it's money, right? But if you got any friends out there, you know, go ahead and, uh, let, let somebody, let somebody buy that one off of you for the, for the right price, maybe a, an extra 30 bucks for your troubles or something like that. Maybe. Um, all right. I'm looking at, I'm looking at Wolfpack and I'm going to, I'm going to spread, spread their whole uh, we've got who is this? This is Dilo. Looks like he's got he's going to be able to get one. Um, I won't say too much, but um, Graham, hmm, not what I was expecting. You show me a, a Captain America thing. So, Graham, let us know when you're in. Ooh, three now. All right, dude. Tell us the prices. Tell us the prices. It's okay. We can spoil it on here. Tell us what the prices are when you get in. Actually, don't because you're probably going to be rushing to buy it. So you, oh, I guess if you're on your phone, I don't know. If you can, if you can, let us know. Oh, <laughs> X-Man Supreme said he just got the email. What a joke. Oh. Yeah. Please let us know the pricing if you're in and have the time. Yeah, for sure, guys. Tamara God says 800 Hong Kong. The rest 3,200, I think, is for SciShow. That's dope. That's cool. Uh, okay, Jedi Knight's Watch says $495. That's under five before shipping and tax. Thank you, Graham. That's awesome. That's a good price. Um, when's the when is, did it show the release yet? Like the time frame? Anybody? I guess I'm in soon, but you know, less than 10 minutes. But I, you know, anticipation is killing me. Um slightly cheaper than the joker artisan and that's good that's good and you know what's so special about that too is that we don't have a lot of jack sparrows so it's kind of cool that it's cheaper like they could have easily done more expensive and people still would have bought this thing um because there's just not as many you know but i guess people would have been mad if it was more than like a character like joker or something like that so um flavio is um he did say that he would jump on here afterwards so we might be able to have him on and see if he got his um so i'm kind of looking forward to hearing that if he got it or not october to march of course it's october to march uh so i like like i said guys like if it's 2024 i'll probably pass if it's 2025 i'm gonna i'm gonna cop it and uh, it's right in the middle. So, you know, I'll probably still grab it. And if for some reason I got to cancel it or cancel Guardians or something, I don't know. I guess I'd probably have to cancel Guardians because I feel like I can still get those figures a couple months later. Artisan might be hard to get. So I guess I'll, I'll cop it no matter what. Tyria said, congrats, Graham. Congrats. Secured it. Yep. Movie Canon says congrats too. I, I know I need to get it. I need to get it. I need something other than just like, you know, Marvel and, you know, a few Star Wars figures. I actually need more DC guys. I got the 89 Batman coming. Okay. But all I have for DC right now is Wonder Woman. It's, that's ridiculous. 
ridiculous. I've got some like pre-order stuff, like you know, but I I, I need more. I I guess I'm just like really anal when it comes to that. Like I, I gotta pay attention. Hold on, guys. Hold on. I gotta pay attention. All right. So gotta pull up this window. Ooh. Okay. I got I got I got less than a minute. So I will stop sharing as soon as uh I choose my card and all that jazz. Uh let's see. All right. Let's come on. Come on. It was like it was like speeding up and I was getting so excited. I was getting so excited. All right. I'm going to stop sharing just because I'm a little nervous um with with all of that stuff. Hopefully you guys can still see me while I have the screen minimized. Um but yeah, I'm gonna let you guys. I'm gonna let you guys know the details. Um, I just don't want to like my cards pulling up, and you know, I know it kind of takes out most of the number and whatnot, but it also shows my address and everything else. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with what Jedi and and uh, Az Figs was, and I think Tyria was telling me, don't share your screen. So I am not. I'm gonna be safe. I don't want somebody knocking on my door saying I'm they're a huge fan. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, Let's see. All right, 18, 18. Watch it go like away or something. It's going to be ridiculous. Notify me. It says notify me when it's my turn. Yeah, they're going to notify you like 20 minutes after it's your turn. That's what's going to happen, guys. Um. All right, less than a minute. 18 ahead of me. Come on, come on. Hopefully you guys are still there. Um. 18 ahead. Let's see. I'll give you all the prices here, unless you guys are already commenting. Commenting that in the comment section. I'm not really looking at that at that screen at the moment. So if you guys are, that's fine. But I'll I'll, I'll still kind of run through. Now available to pre-order. Let's go. Buy now. Okay. Um, let's see. So we got the artisan 495. The deluxe is 330. That's a great price. And the collector's edition is 290. Wow, that is that is a smoking good price, you guys. Shoot, I might, I might get the artisan and the collector edition, um, but I'm gonna cop this uh, artisan real quick while I can, and um, and and go from there, guys. Um, let's see, let's see. Boop. All right, gotta put in some some numbers. Let's see. Okay. Okay. So 495. Please don't screw me. Okay, so acknowledge, place your order. Due today, 4950. Goodness gracious. Wife's gonna kill me. All right, it's secured. Let's go. Your order is confirmed. Let's go. I'm so happy. I, I hope you guys are able to get it still. Um, every single one in this chat deserves it. So hopefully you guys are um are good are good to go are i mean this was this is a special one oh yeah so 290 330 and 495 aren't those good prices man like i saw that and i'm like wow like artisan's cool and everything but i mean if you don't get it you luck out with only spending 290 or 330 that's amazing everyone congrats to to graham um x-man laugh it loud dude i almost messed up had the wrong payment info set up oh that would have sucked uh, movie cannon's almost there. Three thirty for the deluxe, yeah, man. Three thirty for the deluxe. That is a great price. That is a great price. I think. I think so. Um, I'm in the queue. Uh, Terry says I'm in the queue, and I don't even know if I want to do it yet with shipping and tax to Europe. Yeah, I feel like I'm a child, and my mom left me in the queue alone without any money. I'm nervous, dude. Just go. What I would do if I was you is go ahead and get it, and somebody's going to want it and then somebody you know what i mean like somebody's going to want to take your pre-order and just put the shipping to them and they can pay you you know what i mean like that's what i would do i don't know and then by the time you have to pay for it you might still want it you know what i mean and then you have the money and whatnot so that's just me don't don't listen to me though um yeah yes uh grats brick 
Thank you. Thank you. Congrats. Thank you guys. Uh, limit to one per customer as it should always be as it should always be. Yes. Yes. Uh, nice brick. Deluxe 330 is sweet. hundred percent. I love that price. Um, I don't know if I would say it's a good price, <laughs> says Jedi. I'd like it for a lot cheaper. Oh, a hundred percent. Yeah. But I don't know. I was expecting like 385 or something like that for the deluxe and like, you know, 330 for the original. Um, one minute. Oh, action in the box. Almost there. He's probably there by now. Uh, Hammer of God. I was spot on projecting to 93.30 and they came in $20 under an artisan, which was nice. Yeah, dude. Great. That's amazing, actually. Um, <laughs> Tyria must resist enabling from brick. <laughs> uh, uh, you're not wrong, though. Let's see. Uh, action the box. Yes, I did it. Congrats. Congrats. Uh, movie cannon secured artisan. So even though he wasn't sure, he secured it. So good man. Good man. You never know who you're going to find that really wants it. Or as time goes by, you might just want to keep it yourself. Um, or a gift to me. I'd, I'd have two. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, congrats to all, Doc Bat. Thank you. Thank you um dx is a good price artisan has me wobbling yeah the artisan price is uh expensive but i get it because it's so limited and they got that you know they add that to the price well it's limited so we added an extra 50 dollars to the price um 50 sold says doc bat wow good luck everybody who's still in the queue um honestly if you guys like don't get it there's going to be somebody who is willing to give you theirs because the, of the price difference and there's still two other versions left for them so they could make 80 bucks right off the bat so or more um x-man says is it weird though that i like how the dx has less volume in the hair it's not weird it's not weird it's your preference man I actually i actually have to look at it a little bit more uh that's what i was going to do on this uh live stream but i i kind of uh, screwed i didn't really screw the pooch um it just kind of happened that way when i found out that it was going live um so i know that graham got it jedi knights watch i got it i wonder if the other two wolf pack members got it dlo sneaker if you're still here how's it going fellas um oh dlo the collector got it bro send me a link oh nice i'll send you a link right now broski oh i just made my day nah. I am so excited. All right. Boom. Boom. Send it to you now, sir. We're going to have some fun. All right. All right, man. I'll see you in a minute. I just sent it to you on Instagram. Um, Let's see. Movie Candy. Yep. I really don't think I'll keep him, but I'll leave it for a good friend who wasn't able to get the artisan jack. Nice, man. See, that's that's a good guy right there. That's a good guy. Uh, brick you give me luck you guys gave me luck i don't if <laughs> if i was only on my phone i'd still be waiting uh because i literally went up 2000 uh by going on my computer because you guys told me to have up multiple windows i didn't know it'd be like multiple or different numbers so dang thank you uh congrats dlo says the movie canon uh probably gonna be on for like another 20 25 minutes uh dlo's coming on so we're gonna be talking about that and then um uh Flavio, uh, House of Collectibles, may or may not come on as well. I wonder how he's doing, uh, whether he's able to get this figure or not. So good luck to him if he's somewhat listening in um, or just send the good luck to them to the, uh, you know. So I got two artisan figures now. I've got Scarlet Witch. I somewhat missed out on Anakin, somewhat didn't. <laughs> Long story there. I'm sure you guys still remember. Um, but I, I definitely missed out on the on the you know i chose not to do the joker um and i chose to just do sculpted uh but yeah i missed so i missed out on anakin through sideshow purchased him from another site realized i'm spending 800 dollars before shipping and i'm like i'm dumb i'm not doing that so <laughs> i canceled that so i will not be getting artisan anakin and um but i i do have scarlet witch which looks amazing. I do hope they darken her up a little bit. She looks very pale. 
Um, and now I got this, uh, this guy. So, uh, Jack Sparrow, I also got Paul Atreides. Um, I know that's in art, but you know, so just getting some, getting some good buys here. Uh, X-Man Supreme brick Artemis, dude, if you weren't live right now, I would have missed it completely. I had no idea it was going live today. Yeah, man. Uh, happy you got it. You know what? If, if you guys all got it and I didn't, I would blame the fact that I was live telling you guys that it's, you know, up. Uh, I'm just kidding. Uh, but no, I'm, I'm glad we're, a lot of us are getting lucky here. Uh, my luck with Artisan pre-order streaks continue. Watch. I'll get effed over next time. <laughs> and it'll be something you really want too, right? Like, man, hopefully you don't. Hopefully you don't. Um, I still don't see D'Lo. But it's all good. Brick Artemis, no, sir. We love a pale mommy. Do you? I mean, she looks good. I think she looks good. I just, I don't know. When I put her side by side with like all three of the Scarlet Witches that came out recently, like or like, you know, Multiverse of Madness, WandaVision, and then of course this one from Endgame. Oh, let's go. Let's oh, go. Oh, hey. Dude, congrats. Where's the party at? Let's go. Where's the party? Dude, congrats! You get man. a Jack Sparrow. You <laughs> get a Jack Sparrow. What's up, everybody? Yes, yes, dude. I I was nervous being on here. That was a lot of work. That was a uh, nerve wracking. Dude, when uh, you guys got your first initial numbers and they were so low, and mine was yeah. in the thousands, I was sweating because I know I started like getting all my browsers up before all you guys, and like the shit is rigged. <laughs> that was my thought. I was like, oh. right. Right, man. I yeah, I saw the number on my phone first. I was like, oh great, like it was like two thousand something, and then I yeah. checked my my other window on the computer. And it was six hundred. I was like, oh, dope. like that's awesome. Like, oh my gosh, this oh, is gonna be my first so. artisan. This is the first is one it? I've actually secured. Yeah, dude, nice. I whiffed nice. on every it's single one. one of them. I know, it's I know. A really good one. Just like sideshow. Can you give a brother a week? I mean, <laughs> right. I, was, I was talking about this thing twelve hours ago for you guys, selling the hell out of it, and you just you almost jipped me. Unbelievable. Yep. Yep. Man, imagine if like those people who are at work and they found out an hour before they couldn't make plans or like, oh, I'm, I'm doing this project and they miss out. Yeah, it's usually you me. Know? That's usually <laughs> me. These <laughs> never happen when I'm off. So it's just like, thank goodness uh, I was off because I told everyone I was going to be studying for which I'm not doing right now. Clearly, man. I'm online talking to you. But yep. yeah, man. Whew. Dang. Let's go, dude. baby. Let's, let's, let's go. go. We got we got a Jack Sparrow. What do you think of those prices for the other two versions? Reasonable. Very, yeah. very reasonable. I mean, the on the secondary market, like the DX15 can be found for around 350 to 400 So I think the uh, the DX for 330 I think that's a sweet spot. In yeah, fact, man. I'm actually a little shocked. I thought it would be more, to be honest yeah. with you. Yeah, same. I uh, Yeah, and you know, that kind of made me feel a little better too, knowing that there are three different versions. Like if I missed out on this one, there's still a deluxe version. Yeah. So it made me feel a lot better. Um, uh, but luckily I was still able to get it. I got this one in Scarlet Witch, I was saying. So I've got two out of the nice, four, right? Nice. And and so yeah, we'll see. And it sounds like all of them might come out this year. Because they're all scheduled for 2024. This one is like 2025 early, most likely. Sure. But but yeah, I mean, we're we're about to get a bunch of artisan figures. I, I feel like Hot Toys is like proving a point. Well, to, I mean, they haven't proved it like, yet, but if, if they hit those right. times there, then yeah, I, I would yeah. agree with you there. I think that's going to yeah. be like statement made for sure if that happens. Yeah. yeah, and they actually have to be, they have to like feel nice. They got to like look good uh, in hand and whatnot. So yeah, man, we got, we got some, some people, some people chatting here. Uh, X-Man Supreme, uh, Hammer God saying X-Man Supreme, what's the easiest way to get hold of you? Okay, okay. So they're, they're talking amongst each other. Um, uh, everyone's saying hi to d -Lo. Action hey everybody! Box, hey D'Lo, movie cannon. Um, let's see. <laughs> Says D'Lo Winfrey. <laughs> let's go. That's um, way better than my name. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's see. Has anyone has anyone talked to how you figure? Oh man, I hope he was able to get one. He wanted one, right? He did. Sure he did. Yeah, yeah he was he definitely. It. Um, do you know the number of this gotcha, GX man. figure? I don't know. I don't know what the number. What's is. the matter? Of the DX figure, like this, I think it's or are they talking about something else? Or uh, is Artisan even? No, it is no Artisan is DX. I think it's DX thirty three. We're up to now. Oh wow! I think so. I think I saw it in the email actually. Let me see. Let me see here. My uh, uh, Artisan. 
Mm, I don't know. Yeah, that's all right. That's all right. Oh, wow. Doc Bat saying it is gone. So that was what? 21 minutes? Ooh. 20 minutes? We did it, boys. Yeah, what's the time? Yeah. Anybody not get it? Anybody not get it that wanted it? I, I feel bad. Um, but yeah, man. Uh, so so obviously you guys talked on the Wolfpack last. Well, I guess it was not on the Wolfpack last night. It was the the uh, the bonus episode, the after party. Wolfpack uh, after hours. We're still yeah. we're still <laughs> we're still working on the name. There you go. Um, and you guys had had a low key collector on there. Ooh, we got somebody else in here. Let's go. What's up, Flavio? What's going on, bro? <laughs> oh, you get How it? Doing? Yes, you get sir. it? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, boy. Let's that. go, dude. And it just Packing's, ran out too. So congrats, sir. Dude, oh, that right. was. Man. I'm not gonna lie. Man. That was that was a really tough cue, to be honest, compared to all the other ones for some reason. Uh, the hardest one for me was uh was Anakin. That yeah. that one was I was like way behind. See, I actually for some reason. I had an easier chance with Anakin compared to Joker. Joker was really like mm. tough, but this one, the only, the only reason that I say that it was tough because I had so many pages up and compared to the other cues, yeah, like the Joker and Anakin one, I had so many different staggered numbers yeah. Um. On on this one, it was they were all pretty much close to the same wait time. So I was just literally just waiting. I was clicking through all of them. And yep. Yeah, we're learning multiple pages. We're For learning. Sure. So luckily, the uh, only ones watching right now seem to be to be uh, friends. So um. So it's okay if they know that they they can know the cheat code. Yeah. Shout but, out to um, everybody that got it. For dude, sure. Dude, shout out to you guys, man. Let's go. And then I know Jedi got it. I, I don't know if Sneaker got it yet. Um, I'm he, sure did. He's I did. he got okay. it. He got it. Post in Discord. Nice. So. Nice. Oh, yeah, of course he did. <laughs> we'll all be celebrating. <laughs> uh, yeah, man. It, it sounds like a lot of people who wanted this are, are getting it. So that's that's awesome. What do you think of the other prices, um, Flavio? For the you other know, two? Honestly, the I didn't even have a chance to look at all the prices, but I'm looking now. Artisan was four ninety five. Deluxe yeah. was. 330 and the collector was 290 i don't really think it's bad you know the m my biggest thing is is the collector just having that diamond base compared to the deluxe and the artisan you you might as well just shell out you know that extra cash and just go big sure. if you wanted to get this to begin with but um the deluxe is a great consolation prize bro like you know, if I wouldn't have mm -hmm. gotten the artisan, I would have been, I would have been just okay. as happy with you know getting the deluxe. I was happy that D'Lo called that too last night, saying that you mm -hmm. know there's going to be more than one skew, and I, I was kind of, I was not sure at first, but you know I took his word for it, and you know when they released the announcements last night at midnight, it just kept popping up, and I was like, wait, this isn't you know this is a different one, and. Yeah. I was like, oh, let's go. It's just weight off your shoulders, you know? Oh, for sure. For sure, man. And and uh, like I think X-Man was saying it like, is it wrong that he or is it weird that he likes the uh, the version where like the hair is not as thick, the deluxe, you know, and it's not it's not weird. It's just, you know, it's a preference. I so. honestly I honestly don't think so either. You know, I think the deluxe and the collectors that have the sculpted, I think they look just as good I, yeah. I think it's kind of tough on images to really get the full gist of how the figure is going to be but just off of images his head looks maybe a little bit bulkier on the artisan and that's sure. that's noted with you know all that rooting but i don't know i think they all look great to be honest yeah have you, have you did you guys have the uh the previous figure i do Was actually i've got the dx15 the one the last one that came out so it's kind mm -hmm. of a, it's like the DX that everybody um, will get if they didn't get the artisan. Um, yeah. So it has that, that partially rooted braid and then it's sculpted with the rest of it there. Honestly, okay. it's fantastic. I like, I never yeah. had any qualms about this here. So like, I, so you're not, so I think for, sorry, I'm sorry. You, you don't have to worry about like everything kind of hanging off of him, like, or on his hair, like that'll fall off or anything like that. Mm -hmm. No, no, not at all. I mean, that thing is built really well. Um, it's I've had it for years now. And I can honestly tell you, like, anybody who wasn't sold on Artisan and said, like, 
I'm going to go with the DX. It's in no way, in my opinion, a consolation prize at all. Like It's a premium figure in its own right. So I think anybody who wanted the Artisan and, and is going to get the DX, I don't think you're going to lose any sleep, quite honestly. Me oh, yeah. personally, I already have the DX, one DX that's like that one now. So I wanted to go a step up. I wanted to bring I wanted to go up a little higher than the last yeah. one there. But but if this was my first Jack Sparrow and I whiffed on the artisan right now, I would be a hundred percent happy with it. Cause I promise you, once you get in the hand, you're gonna see just how good that figure is gonna be on its own right. So dude, I yeah. I can't wait. I'm gonna I'm gonna pull your your picture up real quick, Dilo, of your of your figure or the picture that you took. Sure. Uh, of Jack Sparrow, if that's cool. Let's that's see. cool by me. I think that's we the just, biggest thing too just, for like most collectors. It's just, you know, all those other DXs have, you know, been out for a while and it's tough to to find a good deal on a if if you're concerned on getting a brand new one compared to a pre-owned one and this I know a lot of people, you know, even new collectors have been, you know, chomping at the bits to try to get, you know, um a Jack Sparrow and just the fact that they, you know, drop this on us is it's it's great and i was actually saying this too in uh i think it was hot toys hotlines um group on facebook you know d23 is is pretty much here and it's i feel like we got you know besides the fact that they knew that it was just print and press you know easy make money but they could have very well made this a d23 exclusive and it would have been like 10 times harder to get Mm, that's a good point that's a good point man you know this picture right here Dilo. i don't know how you yeah. do this yeah i wish i could take pictures picture. like this but this looks really good this looks better yeah. than the pictures that you know they took for for <laughs> for the preview for the newest figure <laughs> Yeah, you're too yeah. nice <laughs> i'm <laughs> such an amateur you're way too nice for me man i appreciate that no, this looks good bro um thank you but question for you are you going to keep this figure yeah, yeah, I absolutely am. Um, and the big thing for it is, believe it or not, it's the base. I love this base. Okay. This is still this is still my favorite base out of the three that we're now going to have. I still love this one. Everybody loves the steering wheel, and I can see why. I want it too, but like, I can't sell this figure. I just, I just can't. I love it so much. I mean, I randomly took a picture of my Jack's Row not knowing. I mean, when did I say I posted this on the 11th? I had no idea they were going to make another one. So it's That's not like right. I'm, this was I'm, before. I'm not riding the hype wave of like the new announcement. Like I was like, no, I love this figure, so I'm taking a photo of this figure. Yeah. So yeah, I can't. Yeah, this was, I can't part of it there. Yeah, it wow. was only two weeks ago. But what I like though is that I think it shares a lot of similarities with this one, and there's going to be two different facial expressions with that head sculpt. And the the process to install the face is you just remove. The face itself and you slide in kind of like a soka right if you okay. guys have the dx soka so it's kind of similar kind of process to it there so you just kind of slide it in so what i'm going to do before i do anything is when i get my new one i'm going to see if i can interchange the face plate and put the new one oh. on this one and then that is an easy free upgrade oh, to this one dang that would be awesome to see if that so that i can have an works. awesome i can keep my awesome display base here and then i can have a different version of jack rocking his steering wheel there i think that would dang, look sick cool. together yeah have one with the hat without the hat kind of thing something I mean, like that yeah for sure for sure and that'd be cool that'd be cool Speaking yeah of ni hat, nice you, uh nice photography bro i like it do you guys do you guys think that the hat may be an issue with the with the artisan one specifically you know on and off maybe over time or is it all sculpted up top too then or no, he's got that red bandana it's right? it's rooted all the way to the back too oh that's what i meant rooted my bad um but he still has that that red bandana over the top that could save that right like you're putting it on top of that right but i, I just wonder how like is the hat gonna fit snug yeah. or if you just set it on top of it is it gonna look kind of like you know <laughs> top yeah. hat ish you know yeah. what i mean yeah. i got you very possible that's going to be a good test here because like this is an artisan figure that you know has an accessory that you're supposed to put on the head none of them right. have that problem there so um something like that's something to watch out for because it it's going to take a skilled uh rooting job from hot toys to make sure that something like that doesn't happen because collectors are going to go back and forth and want to change the look of their of their jack sparrow and take the hat on take the hat off on the sculpted one non-issue 
right. non-issue yeah. whatsoever right. there. But on the artisan, yeah, Flavio brings up an excellent point. So it's gonna gonna be something you're gonna have to keep an eye on and, and possibly maintain yourself. With, but that's thinking, with yeah. any rooted figure, though. That's what any I was thinking figure, that, and I I don't know. I'm I might just you know at first play it safe just to see how it is. I might just have him you know holding the hat or something or placing it on the helm or something. Yeah, I might steal Delo's uh, Delo's look there. <laughs> it's a that but on this on photo. the steering wheel. Yeah, I love it, man. So this this right here is just the deluxe version that I'm showing. This is not artisan. So yeah, his hair does look a little thinner, but still looks really good. And yeah, it is like rooted on the left. Uh, so on the right picture, you can see it's rooted up top too, and that's like not covered by the bandana. So yeah, that would worry me a little bit with that hat. Right. But. Mm. So hype. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. You guys so, are going to love it. I'm telling you. Dude, I Jack can't Sparrow, wait. They make it's it such great. An, it's such an intricate figure too. Like, I just love all like the little, you know, beads and everything hanging off his hair. And, you know, this part right here where he has, you know, all, all like the, I don't know what the vest and it, it, it looks so sick. Yeah. Johnny Depp's the goat too. So, do you, do you think he's coming back for the new movie? No, I heard. I heard he's no. not. Same, I, I heard he's not on. too. But I. But then I saw something. I saw something else that. I so I saw one thing that it would be a complete remake, mm -hmm. or reboot. That's I what I heard too. And then, but then I also saw something else that Johnny Depp said that the only way that he would come back is if Disney, uh, ap like publicly uh, apologizes. And I doubt they. So, are. but I don't know if he actually <laughs> can, said that or if that was like just you know. We can thank it, so Amber Heard. Disney for still that. owes Star Wars Thanks. fans apologies. They're not going to give Johnny Depp an apology. Sorry, <laughs> that's, that's true. That's true. Um, Where's my apology for the Last Jedi? Huh? Still waiting. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. I mean, he got he got he lost all his jobs and stuff, didn't he? Like, yeah, you know? yeah. He, yeah lost man, his, he lost uh, his his gig with the uh, with the Harry, Harry Potter, Potter spinoff. Stuff. Remember that? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And they kept her on, you know, Aquaman. What a shame! Yeah, what a joke! Yeah. Well, well WB joke. though different. Yeah. That would yeah. be a different company, but yeah, you're right. Yep. So Jerry Shitty says, situation. Uh, today I bought my first hot toy, and you are to blame. <laughs> well, congrats on your first hot toy, man. That's that's pretty awesome. Welcome um, to the clan. And it's an artisan. Your first hot toy is an artisan. Very cool. Yeah, Very cool. seriously, man. Setting the bar high day one. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, you're gonna be disappointed everything like after unless it's yeah. all <laughs> it's not, don't say that to him. No, they're just, you're gonna find another one. <laughs> uh Tira says I got dinner. Thanks for the fun and stressful stream. Uh lol. <laughs> Congrats, everyone. All right, man. Enjoy your food. Uh let's see. X Man, I'm happy as hell to have secured the artisan. I would have loved the DX as well, but it's nice to have the con consistency for sure. For sure. Um so what do you guys think is coming next or what do you hope? I mean, obviously we don't know. We can't really make a good guess, but what do you guys hope comes next with artisan that you could see them doing? There's so many options, man. There's really, I don't know. Flavio, you want, you want to take this one, man? I, I honestly dude with this, with this teaser, I just, mm -hmm. it's so left field. You know what I mean? I mean, mm -hmm. I guess it was a, a figure that was already made to an extent so it was an easy redo but in reality you know who was asking for this recently like let I, that's just me where i'm thinking about it like i know a right. lot of people have wanted a jack sparrow but the timing of this is just so weird i mean it could like again it could be yeah. a possibility of the d23 expo coming you know about and them announcing that reboot but it just it has no ties to that new movie. So it's just the only thing that I could think of, which I put it, you know, in the discord too, you know, and when you, you guys were talking about it last night, Graham was saying, is this uh, a sign that, you know, all those possible early DX figures and all those so-called grail figures, is this their way to re-implement that those figures again? And, rooting wise the only the only one that i could possibly see them and, and just me guessing off the top of my head just because i don't i don't know i would say that they could possibly do uh artisan crow figure 
That'd be cool. Ooh, okay. That'd be cool. I could okay. see them doing that because I feel like, you know, it's somewhat of a long hairstyle. It's probably easy for them, you know, kind of just like the Joker kind of style hair. And everybody raves about that, you know, original Hot Toys figure that they did. And, you know, implementing the leather jacket. You see tons and tons yeah. of uh, postings that, you know, that figure has flaking. So that's the only mm. one that could come out of my mind right away. But I, I don't know about you, D'Lo. I don't know if you have anything. Well, I, I don't have anything like, like I have, I have a personal favorite that I'd like them to do, uh, which I've said many, many times. Thor from Avengers 1, I think that one oh, is man. justifiably due for yeah. an upgrade. Uh, but trend wise here, what this would make this now, what do we have? We have just a quick head count. So we have artisan Anakin. We have Joker artisan. We have Wanda artisan. We now have Jack Sparrow artisan over here. Now, am I missing any? I think that's this it. Four, right? Yeah, I think that's three it. out of the four, three out of the four Disney owned three out of four Ooh, Disney owned. It's a good point. So, something to consider there. Um, I think, think there it's it's going to be that i think it's going to be a combination of strictly for now i'm thinking it's going to be basically marvel dc star wars right now on this artist and stuff here this is a one-off because it's a, it's a disney product here so that's that's easy for them they have the license for disney stuff so stuff like the crow i would love that because i'm a major fan and that older figure with the pleather issues yeah it, it would definitely do for one i don't know if it would be like as sought out besides like people like you and me who are huge fans of it there. But um, I think that's something that's mainstream enough is something like a princess Leia or yeah. maybe dark side Anakin. <laughs> dark side Anakin. Well, that would be an easy one, right? Um, no, oh. another one that comes to mind here is probably, um, probably something you, I think you've said this multiple times too, Bricks. So I don't want to steal it from you here, but no, go I for say, it. Man. Um, I would say Black Widow is a kind of a no-brainer. I'd like to see an Iron Man 2 Black Widow her when she first oh, appeared. Oh, dude. That, that would be, be an amazing. awesome one. That'd be an awesome I got one. This, I got this big-ass poster of her from uh, Iron Man 2. Of course I do, right? Um, and, and it's just like, I really need that figure. Really yeah. bad. I, I love that suit. I love that look, the hair, the way her hair is in that movie. Um, and it's, I don't know. I just really like that, but... Harley Quinn too. Like mm. I really want that Harley Quinn figure and yeah. to have that rooted and for them to fix the kneecaps and maybe have a second head sculpt or a faceplate would be super, super cool. Um, maybe with like a, the mouth closed and the other one, you know, you keep that, that mouth open. Um, but yeah, I mean, it would be, that'd be really cool. And then of course, like star Wars, you can go, you can pretty much say any figure in star Wars and, and people are going to be like, yeah, that, you know, like be all excited <laughs> about it. So um, whether it's Princess Leia, I mean, even Padme, people would be happy about. Uh, but yeah, Dark Side Anakin, I could see that. Isn't isn't that coming like um like next year? Isn't that an anniversary or am I tripping for for revenge? No, I think or, we're yeah. years. we just had the twentieth for Attack of the okay. Clones. So Okay. I thought Actually, something no, was think, coming. You might be right. I think next year. And I think next year is the anniversary. Yeah, so I could I could see that for like whenever that is, whether it's next year or the year after, and they might be saving it for that. I don't know. What about a Gamora? But that would be cool. Gamora would be great. That would be cool because they haven't really announced it, announced her for that line yet, and she's got like a different outfit, so that would be cool to have mm. her. Do you think you they know. would do from the new movie or the original? Like, I would the prefer one. the original, but yeah, I mean they did they did the fifth movie with uh, pirates here, so you know. True. Um, yeah, just yeah, just so many artists and yeah. should have been. Go ahead, Curse of the Black Pearl. This this should yeah. be a Curse of the Black yeah. Pearl movie. I yeah, would love agreed. that one there, but what are you gonna do? For sure, for sure. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Um, do you now? I, the, I sorry. Do you think the ship window is accurate on this one? Do you think we're gonna see it twenty four or twenty five? I think it's coming twenty five. Yeah, I think so too. What do you Same. think, Adila? Yeah, I mean Wonder Woman. The WB one hundred one that took a minute, you know that that I know it's not artisan technically, but it kind of is, and yeah. like that, I mean people forget like that one took a hot minute after they said it was a release and all that other stuff. Like people were waiting for a hot minute to get theirs. So yeah. I don't know if it's a coincidence. I don't know if that's just because it was the first one, but 
I don't know, man. I think with this here, this feels like this would take more time for Hot Toys than a standard regular release that they would typically do. So I, right. I, I paid my NRD and I'm going to sit back and relax. And whenever it happens, it happens. But I, I don't expect to get this in hand for a while. Facts. Mm. Yeah, I, I could see like even, you know, for a while, like even past the window, like a month or two after. Yeah, because um, it's saying October yeah. 24, March 25 as of right now. Yeah, yeah. But I'm hoping it is 25, like I was saying at the beginning of the stream, because too much shit is coming out this year. Yeah. <laughs> I can wait. I can wait. Uh, checking in with the chat here real quick. Um, just kind of popping around. Uh, X-Man says, but didn't he still get paid for the Harry Potter thing because of his contract? He might have. He did. You know, um, he did. Okay. He still got wow. paid. That's win for him. <laughs> Sucks for us, but move. win for him. Uh, we've got a uh, action in the box saying next artisan Terminator. Sarah Connor would be cool. That'd be sweet. Connor would be good. We yeah. just need more yeah. turn Terminator in general. In general, hundred uh, percent. I was thinking too, like Ripley. That'd be another cool artisan. But like you said, it's you know it's not Disney. So uh, Kyle, I had the chance to get the artisan, but decided to get the sculpted DX. I couldn't justify the one hundred sixty plus price difference. I'm so excited to finally have. A Captain Jack Sparrow in my collection. Dude, that's a nice pickup. Like that, nothing you know, wrong with that. That's yeah, it's just a good price point. Uh, we got one six GJ saying he thinks Thor. That'd be cool. Or he wants Thor. Uh Jerry, Vikings or Lord of the Rings. Dude, I would love some Vikings figures from really anybody. I, I, would I really love Lord of the that Rings. Show. And Lord of the Rings. Like if, if they if they would start competing with Lord of the Rings and come out like that, oh yeah. Let's go. I mean, you got uh, NR doing Lord of the Rings, so that's kind yeah. of their jam right now. I don't now, think so. Hot Toys doesn't have that license, do they? No. no. Mm -hmm. sure uh, they Dude, but I swear a long time ago, before they even announced that in our Harry Potter, I swear Hot Toys teased something just saying like we were doing something with the Wizarding World. Like that would be mm -hmm. cool. If they I remember that. You remember that, right? I remember Wasn't that, that the yeah. logo. Wasn't it the logo of like the newer stuff though? Like the uh, I don't I like, don't remember. I feel like it was just so vague. They just left it open, hmm. like. And we no, never it was going to be else. Harry Potter specific. It wasn't going to be what's the other one called again? Fantastic Beast. It wasn't going to be something yeah. like that. Right. Yeah. So yeah, because I, I think thought after it was... that. Okay. But if they did a rooted Hermione and all of that, oh man, I'd be that'd be cool. So in. Uh, I think Hot Toys scared away. Yeah, I think Sorry. they are too. Because no, don't worry about it. I'm the one going off here. Um, but yeah, I think they're scared away too. I mean, they already got what two out or one out, one about to be released. Uh, in our dose. Well, not just that, the um the Hot Toys Fantastic Beast figures they did terrible. Yeah, they did. They oh, sat really? there forever. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I don't think uh I don't think Hot Toys really cares to jump back into sure. the Wizarding World anytime soon. Sure. That's probably a good idea too. Uh Widow would be amazing for sure. Uh her hair was amazing in Iron Man too. 100 percent Ooh, we got another guy that got it. Kiro got it. Let's go. Yeah, Congrats. there you go, buddy. Congrats, Congrats. man. Secure Let's the go. bag. Let's go. If they did Artisan Harley in the red dress, I bet that's what they do. That would be cool. Mm -hmm. That would be cool. Part of me would love that. Part of me would be disappointed because I, I didn't get that that uh classy harley quinn from suicide squad but you know any harley would be good uh the payment plan on sideshow has the final payment posted december 2024 so i bet comes out no earlier than 2025 yeah that i mean that could always change but but yeah mm -hmm. I, I i agree uh terminator lol a rooted high and tight <laughs> uh, yeah let's start a movement master chief diecast let's go Oh uh, man, that's I, I'm sure they would have to pay a buttload of money to oh, get yeah. the rights for Master Chief, um, especially for just for just one figure. But um, anything else you guys want to say about the artist in line or this figure in general? Oh, um, I got one go thing. Go one thing. Where's the rum? Yeah, yeah, I saw you guys talking about that. There's no Where's rum bottle. The rum. There's no I, rum. I think you're right on it too. Like Disney wise, they're just on their woke stuff, and <laughs> that's what I think too. True. Like you know, wow, can uh can market alcohol. So, I mean, hopefully somebody does a custom or something Somebody's, that should be easy yeah. or something, right? I got one with my DX15. I'm good. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I got my run. Yeah. 
<laughs> I need a rum bottle. I'm gonna have to find that now. I'm gonna search right after the show. Yeah, he only comes with the the bottle with the the ship in it. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Gonna put him on Dang. eBay for two hundred bucks just for the bottle. Yeah, <laughs> come on, hot toys. <laughs> right, just for the bottle. <laughs> uh, yeah, Loki just popped in. Thanks for being here, man. Why is the rum gone? Shaking my damn head. Yeah. Come on. We need the rum bottle. Um so guys, luckily all three of us were able to to uh, cop this figure, the artisan version. Um, super excited about that. Hopefully, uh, most of you are able as well. We had about eighteen in the house throughout the show, so I appreciate you guys uh, tuning in. Please make sure though before you leave to like uh, the video. Uh, but yeah, next live stream will be Monday night uh, on the Beagle Six. We're gonna have uh, Battle Damage Flavio back on. <laughs> so Steve, it is you april you fool's started. day <laughs> it is april fool's day so hopefully hopefully you can come up with like a cool game or something you know some segments uh dilo obviously you're invited uh to pop on too if you would like to to do a bugle six episode next week um but yeah just uh some some good stuff got family in town so wasn't able to make the wolf pack uh wednesday last night so apologize for that dilo my boy um All but good, bro. definitely we'll be back on next week Excited for that. Hopefully, we get some more drops. Let me uh, add something that real too quick break here, guys. Yeah, man. So, hey, listen, you guys need to watch my boy Brick shows. You got to like them. You got to subscribe to them. You never know who's going to pop up. This was an unannounced D Lo sighting. Okay. Graham can show up anytime. <laughs> Sneak can show up anytime. I can call Justin's collections today and he'll pop on Brick show. Okay. He <laughs> owes me right. a favor. Okay. Yep. So, Definitely show my boy Brick some love. Subscribe, like, leave a comment before you leave. Let him know he's doing a great job because he is killing it right now. Keep on Let's bricking, go. motherfuckers. Let's go. Thank you, Dila. <laughs> Thank I appreciate you. that, man. I appreciate course, that. Man. Um, yeah, came out came out with a video last week, um, collecting success, and that's pretty much it. What's going on? I like I said, I do have a video coming out uh, with my niece. She's you know first impressions of the collection, what figures kind of stick out to her. To, you know a fun video not expecting it to go crazy but just trying to have some fun while she's here do some do some stuff like that but guys what do you guys have going on in your channels i'll start with you Dilo. sure so for me in regards i had to put a quick little break on my video here because i actually should be studying right now and my wife is going to kill me as soon as i get off in a second here because i said i wasn't going to <laughs> do anything today or this week and all that stuff like that there but i was like yeah i was hyped up i, I secured the bag so i was like Fuck it, I'm jumping on whatever. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna re uh, I'm gonna get back to things once I uh, finish my uh, my renewal of my licenses and stuff like that for work. But once I'm done with that, I'm gonna go ahead and drop the Cobb Vanth video, aka should you be collecting with your friend Starn Evil Sneaker? So he's gonna make a little appearance, just in photo only. He's not gonna actually be in the like in the video there, but it's his fault that I bought it. So I'm gonna I'm gonna put him on blast for that there. Then after that. I, I just announced yesterday that I'm gonna I'm gonna have my very first contest and it's gonna be a unique one here. So I'm gonna drop a photo on Instagram later on this afternoon with a picture of one of my cases. Okay. And the contest is very simple. If you own any of the figures that's in that case, I want you to send me a picture of your best pose for that figure. And I'm gonna drop the video with every figure repose from what I get from everybody who submitted a photo. And the winner nice. is going to get a special gift from from me. Ooh, that's, that uh, rum bottle? Uh, no, <laughs> I'm getting that rum bottle. <laughs> that's two hundred dollars in the black market today. I'm not giving that up for a giveaway. <laughs> You're out of your mind. Mm. No, but it should no, be fun. Be so, fun. Um, when is yeah, that? So if, if you're not subscribed to me on Instagram and you want to participate, it is Deal the Collector on Instagram. You can follow me on there. That should be dropping sometime in the next hour. And. Oh, nice. Just DM me directly with your photo. I'll I'll put that in there. I will go ahead and pick the best ones. I'll do all the reposing, drop the video, and the winner will be announced in it. Very nice. Very nice. Dude, I'm excited for that. I'm gonna I'm gonna participate if I have any of those figures. Even though I hate posing. I love posing, yeah. but I hate I want reposing. people to pose yeah. more. That's the thing. I want to get yeah. people yeah. to get excited about posing again. For too sure. many uh sure. too many figures out there that look like scarecrows. Like uh my my Wonder Woman right here. There's only so much you can do with that. Like that's a pass. Don't worry, you're fine. <laughs> right, right. Uh, what about you, uh, Flavio? What you got going on? Healing up? Yeah, I'm healing up, man. Trying to get better each day. So my channel's been kind of like on the pause right now. But 
before I got injured, I was working on my bo video. So I'm hopefully going to be working on that and finishing that up and then just continuing what I was doing and moving through that. Um, I pretty much, yeah, I'm going to be on your show on Monday. Um, yeah. Got a couple figures coming in this week. Finally, the Batman is shipping now from Sideshow. So I know a lot of people are excited about that. Um, but yeah, just with my injury, man, it's just, it's kind of tough right now to do content, but I'm trying to get back into it. I'm starting to feel a little bit better. So hopefully I start trumping through it and for you sure know, getting some videos pumped out because I kind of miss doing my thing. It's, you know, for us, it's kind of like therapy, you know what I mean? And it just sucks yep. that I haven't been able to do any content. So looking forward to getting back out there and um, getting some videos out for you guys. I oh, mean that would be awesome. Uh, happy the the uh, the uh, injury healing the healing of the injury is uh, is it sounds like it's kind of successful, right? It's going yeah quickly yeah or? it's okay it's kind of been you know I've been just so up and down, man. You know, like mentally, you know, you just yeah, yeah. trusting the process and listening to the doctors yeah. and whatnot and doing my physical therapy and I, I personally am feeling better than you know I was, so I know I'm moving forward but it's just yeah. it's still still a long road man it's just not an injury that you know i would want to see anybody go through so right no man, I, uh, man. Def definitely thinking about you excited for monday night and just extremely happy and honored that you guys were still able to hop on the show kind of talk about some figures uh real quick though before we hop off um one six figure focus what is up man mm. thanks for stopping in uh we are about to end the show but please feel free to watch the replay uh, I will add uh, your guys' uh, link to your YouTube channels and Instagrams in the uh, description below once the video, once we're done here. Um, but, but yeah, thanks for being here. Appreciate you guys. And um, yeah, guys, until next time, you know, you know what to say. Keep on breaking. Keep on breaking, motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs>